What's up guys, SHOT Show 2022. We are here at the QSP booth. Got some cool stuff. Let's talk knives. What's up guys, we are here at QSP with David. David, how are you doing, man? Really good, thanks for coming by. You guys got some cool stuff, so let's just jump into it. Yeah, so QSP, now that we've been known for a lot of different knives, Penguin, probably the most, there's about, about 36 different variants now. We have all the exclusives as well, but we do have a lot of other knives out there, so look at our website, qspknife.com. Uh, we have a lot of new stuff. We're gonna have probably about seven to eight um, different models this year, uh, even a slip joint as well, so that's gonna be something that we're gonna kind of expand on. It's exciting. See, yeah, definitely see what's gonna happen with it. And so we're gonna basically start from we kind of got the basics of the budget side, so we're kind of treat, treat, like, treat it like Kia. We're gonna go take it from the baseline, 100,000 mile uh, car, horrible car, but we're gonna move up, we're gonna get better, we're gonna take on different markets. So we're gonna get into the mid-range. So that's where we're going with some of it. So we're gonna start with some of the mid-range one. A new Osprey uh, is available now. Uh, so this is gonna be the Osprey knife. Um, and I failed it right there, but this is gonna be the Osprey. Uh, that's going to be one that we're going to have available and of course knife safety i handed it open of course but that's going to be a bad thing about it but there's a lot of different models on that that's going to be about 60 to 70 dollars to you guys uh, granted uh, prices may change but that is available at the dealers currently so they can pick that up if you like it that much then go and uh, contact blade hq and say hey where's my osprey and right. then so we can get it in get it sold out to you folks and actually get that going because that's a new model that is also the newest one with a wire clip uh, yeah, so, I noticed that. Yeah, so if you want a wire clip and you're like, I, out of all the knives, I only want knives with wire clips, do that and you can pick that up. Uh, you can probably do some aftermarket clips as well if you want to throw that on to the knife too. Uh, Super so it should cool. Be, yeah, should be the same one for that. Super cool. I love, I love what you guys are doing here with the scales. Yep. Super cool stuff, guys. Yeah, definitely. We got a lot of different things. Uh, the next one we're going to roll into is going to be a, a new one for us. Uh, it's probably a new one for a lot of people. Uh, so it's going to be the aluminum foil and the, uh, the copper foil. So a lot of people like copper, uh, but uh, that weighs um, like an anchor in your pocket. Yeah, so it's a lot of weight. Uh, so this is going to be you know, like the Penguin. This is a flipper variant. So we're going to see if we're going to bring this out or not, uh, but we are going to be having this available in some other models. Uh, so that is going to be uh, for the Hawk. We're going to definitely bring it out on the Hawk, uh, but that's going to be one that's called the Copper Foil. Uh, so it's going to be a little bit into the premium side of things, but that's going to be kind of where we're looking at now going forward is trying to go from the budget to the mid-range because a lot of times we bring out a knife and then some people don't really think of QSP as a higher grade knife and we, can, we definitely have the ability, we definitely have the tools oh. available for that. So that's Oh, I agree 100%. Yeah, so on top of the copper, we do have the aluminum one. So there's going to be what that looks like for um, that knife. So that's an aluminum foil. So same type of thing, topographical look, uh, just really a neat design. Uh, so you have something that's different even if your buddy has the same knife, uh, then it's going to be a different knife when you pull it out of your pocket compared to what they have. So it's going to be a neat little setup. Super fun. Yeah. Unique pattern. I yeah. like that, that uh, whatever knife you get is unique to yourself. Yeah, indeed. Right. That's super fun. Yeah, so really cool pattern. That honestly, like that is, it's super fun. Super, like you said, topographical map kind of a, yeah. kind of a idea here. Yeah, because I know Raindrop and Carbon Fiber, when we came into SHOT Show 2020, um, that was before everything shut down. I mean, we had the Raindrop Carbon Fiber, right. and then that's where like other companies were coming over checking it out, and then you can see that on a lot of other knives. So we're really trying to bring out some interesting scales that will make it into the market. Oh, absolutely. No, that's cool. Really cool. Yeah, and so the Hawk side, now Hawk's already available, but these are another one that we see the two different variants. Uh, these are definitely coming out of the market. Uh, the other ones, uh, as far as the Flipper Penguin, we're trying to see if that's going to be available and if people really want that as far as that coming out. Uh, and then uh, we actually, let's go to this one first. So we had the Mamba before. Uh, this is going to be the new Mamba. Now this is going to be uh, a budget variant. Uh, so this is going to be about uh, 40 to 50 bucks probably in your hand. Uh, some people say it looks like a Skyline. Uh, so that's where, I don't know if that's the case or not. Uh, but they did discontinue the Skyline, so if you're missing your Skyline, your Skyline may have died or something, maybe this is the knife for you. Uh, There's a D2 blade knife for 40, 50 bucks, and actually has a detent, which is nice. Um, yeah, I noticed that. Yeah, I so. noticed that. that... Yeah, 
That's yeah. nice. Yeah, so now, ending it out, now we do have some premium lines, but this is going to be a little hamster. Uh, so this is going to be one that you're going to have really small. This is going to be a little hamster knife. Uh, so it goes along with the name pretty well as far as what that looks like. And that's going to be titanium and M390 coming from QSP. Uh, so now we have those abilities. Uh, and if you've seen some of the other knives out there, now we do have um, other OEM work. Uh, that has done uh, premium lines as well. So and then we're trying to uh, get into both sides of that. And then the, even the OEM sides are doing really well for us. Yeah, that, this one's fun. I like, I like the little guys, you know? Mm. You can get good pinch grip, put yeah. your finger up, good purchase. That's cool. Yeah, so that's just a little bit of a tip of the iceberg type of thing. We have a lot of other knives at the show. Uh, so if you're here, check it out. Uh, if you have other coverage, uh, look at those things as well. But definitely check out the website, uh, qspknife.com. That'll give you all the latest knives that we have, and then it'll give you know um, when to uh, bug Blade HQ. To, you know, like, I really want that knife, you know, so that's really where you want to push it. Guys, let me know in the comments what you guys want us to have on the site. Let us know, and we're going to try to make that happen. Super cool designs. I think these are fun as well. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Yeah, so if you like those, let them know because this is going to be a premium variant. 20 CV uh, is an idea for that. So moving it up a little way, but it's going to be extra large, mini, and that's the penguin that's already really popular. All right, this is a great size, guys. Super fun. I've been messing around with it. Super fun. I do want to show just this thing real quick. Yeah, all the milling on there. Yeah, the milling is beautiful. Yep, and that is the Osprey available now. So if Blade HQ doesn't have it, go to their site. If it's not there, no, bug them a little bit. I like that. Yeah. Guys, let us know what you guys want. Uh, jump down in the comments. Let us know. Make sure you guys like, subscribe. Check out our playlist of other SHOT Show 2022 content. And we will catch you guys on the next one. Thanks a lot.